Hi, welcome again to 5-Minute Revit. Today, we will see a very important tool that uh, help people to change the units from imperial to metric or from the metric to imperial. And some people, they get confused sometimes because they have the old mentality of CAD or they didn't know that. Today, I will clarify and give a very important tips how to customize your unit and how to customize your views or your floor plans to get both units in a project. You, you can get metric or you can get imperial. Let's see how it works. Like this project out of the box, I have here the project in Imperial. I want to change it to metric. Very easy. I go to manage here. I go to project unit and I go to linked here and change here to millimeter. Okay. Very easy and simple. Like now you have the unit, the metric, but if I select that one, that mean here I have this uh, dimension type that say linear like here that say it is imperial. Okay, but it's easy. It's not problem. I can, for example, just select this one and I duplicate it. I duplicate this type. I name it like, for example, linear. Okay, and I name it metric with the exact size. Like uh, just I do that example for that and just here i will have it like that if i want to get back here i can get the other like here and you see here for example i it's a stay in metric but the trick is here like edit here i want i want here to unit format and i will select and i say use a project setting it's a checked okay that's mean this it will use a project setting but if i uncheck it like that and i keep it like feet and fraction inch okay okay now you see the track here now it's it's a, it's it's only changed in this view uh, in this uh, uh, type it doesn't change in the whole project but it's still that the project unit it's still a metric okay but i can select it like that and get back to here metric and i have it here metric that means i can personalize my projects unit i can get and there is another tool that it's very important like i can select this one and edit type and i duplicate that type and i name it metric imperial okay i can get both okay okay now if i go here and i change here to be like fraction inch or feet and fraction inch and i put okay and i put it here below and i get both unit like you see here I get both in a metric and I get it in also in imperial. Now it's I can change his here the scale and keep the scale to 100 if I want. I can go here and customize the scale and I put it 150. Okay, I can display it also. That's mean when I get here, you can see here I display it here. This is how you can change the project unit and you can personalize your, the project unit. Even you start a project with Imperial or Metric, you can personalize always in a Revit. I hope this trick help you to uh, to increase your productivity in Revit. Uh, see you in the next video with five minute Revit.